more than four decades, students at McLennan Community College have learned from Waco musician Dick Gimbel. Our Abby Loring shares how the guitarist will be retiring after years of teaching. The son of famous Texas fiddler Johnny Gimbel had big shoes to fill once he entered the music scene. But Dick Gimbel is a man of many talents. He's not only gone on to make a big impact in the music industry, but also as an educator. Being the son of the fiddle legend Johnny Gimbel, Dick Gimbel fell in love with music and began playing guitar at 14. I've been playing in the band at Midway High School for, you know, ever since seventh grade or something. But I, I wanted to play that guitar and he started giving me lessons. And then I got into playing the upright bass, and that's where I started getting to, to play gigs. He just loves music uh, uh, so much that that you know, we feel it. It's just smooth and, uh, and, and sounds great. I mean, he, he's inspiring to watch. Dick Gimbel went on to play in several Austin bands and even recorded and played with famous country stars like his dad, Bob Wills, Merle Haggard, and Willie Nelson. I said, man, I'm kind of in a quandary. I, I got an offer to move back to Waco and teach at a college, and I'm trying to decide. And he said, well, Dick, I figured it out. I grew up in Waco, and I've decided when I get too old to have a good time, I'm going to move back to Waco. <laughs> anyway, that's the Willie side of it. In 1981, Gimbel began sharing his love and knowledge of music and Western Swing with students at MCC. He inspired me to, to learn other instruments other than just guitar. The whole Gimbel clan has left a legacy of music, you know, for all time. And then he has uh, instilled that into his students, too. I'm so thankful. I'm still in Waco. This is a good place. Gimbel retired from teaching on December 7th, but his legacy and talent at MCC and in the music industry will live on forever. Even though he's no longer in the classroom, this is not the end for Dick Gimbel. He did tell me that he's excited to get back to writing songs and making more music. Reporting in Waco, I'm Abby Loring, 25 News.